All right, Rojo Cars back with another video. I'm gonna turn these lights on so you guys can see a little bit better. Yeah, 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 yeah. Look, look. Why the fuck you eating my car, bro? The fuck is wrong with you? I don't really care. <laughs> but anyways, uh, so we actually coming back with an interesting video today. Uh, I actually do not have the right paint right now, but I'm just gonna do it because I'm that nigga. You geeked up, that's why. I'm yeah, I'm kind of geeked up. Huh? Yeah, I'm just I'm just geeked up. So I I want I kind of want to do it now. So uh, I'm gonna have to do this twice. But this is gonna be like my undercoat, I guess. I'm not probably not supposed to do this because it's like a leather paint. I guess you could say no. Nah. Anyways, I mean there's leather on it, but uh, yeah, I mean uh, so I'm using this yellow paint to paint my paddle shifters. And I was gonna actually use the paint that I used for my calipers to actually do this. But, uh, I let somebody borrow my, my, my paint. So, uh, yeah. So, uh, I don't have that paint now. Dumbass mistake. It's, it's been months I had that paint. But, I mean, cause I, cause I used it. But, I mean, if I had it, I would have done this. Anyways, gee, end of story. All right. But, so, I'm gonna, I'm gonna just start with this. Uh, just Angelus paint this this for shoes man shoes for shoes it might work hopefully like I, I know these like tend to like crack type but like if i get to it with the caliper paint that could actually stand the cold and all that shit then uh i could just put that last coat on and it, it, i think it'll be valid so i'm gonna just use this as an undercoat basically and then i'm gonna do the last coat with the caliper paint or last two coats with the caliper caliper paint i just want to see how it would look and how good i am right now and this is lucky like you could mess up and then use uh what's it called alcohol and take it off basically so i mean no harm no foul yeah be started with this exactly so the other one's like thicker so it's like way more permanent so uh i mean maybe i'll show you guys uh the process i'm using this little paintbrush uh maybe i'll show you guys uh have real like show you guys maybe i'll start on this side just on this side or that side because you can't really uh anyways We'll start on whatever side you guys see, and then uh, basically, I'm gonna just start painting it. Boom. All right, so now I'm gonna pour this in there. Damn, this flat is bright as hell. <laughs> this shit bright. I'm gonna just pour this right here. Hopefully, I don't fuck this up. Like, hopefully, I don't, you know, put this on the rest of my car and shit. Be like, that's my goal right now, G. All right, because I'm kind of clumsy. I'm gonna go. Hey, look, I just threw the bottle down on the seat like it was normal, bro. Like, I don't care, bro. Fuck it. Anyways, all right, G. So we are gonna take this glob. See, like you see how it's it's more like the it's just thinner. So it's gonna go on thin. So, oh, G. I'm putting this on a G37, G. Oh man, all right. So, I see all that. I'm gonna just basically keep going with a little. Cause once I get the first coat on, it's gonna start coming on better. So. Uh, I gotta just be precise as hell. So I'm gonna just basically keep doing this. Feel me? Get that first coat on. I'll show you guys what it looked like after it's done. But that's when it be cold. Maybe y'all want me to finish out the uh, the top for y'all. Yeah, just finish out. Let's finish see. it out. Let's see it. Let's see what it looks like. See what, what it's looking like. Oh shit! This shit about to be cold. That's that precise hit. You see that? Oh man, I got it a little bit. That was because the brush though. The brush bristles bogus. Yeah. Now that was me. No, actually, I didn't even. Yeah. I was barely even touching the edge. I'm cool. Yeah, it looked look decent though on camera. Yeah, lucky. And this is only the first coat, y'all. Damn. Ooh, wee. So, I mean, after the first coat, it's lucky going to start uh, to basically thicken up and stick more. So, I mean, let me see on the camera. I want to see. Okay. Yeah. So, I mean, I'm going to show you the top part. Oh, it's kind of. You need to focus. All right. I'm going to. Oh, wait. Hold on. It's, it's kind of getting better. There we go. Ew. Kind of look bogus for now. <laughs> but it's gonna get better. I'm gonna uh, fix it up and stuff. So just stay in tune. 
first coat is bogus as fuck. I'm not gonna lie. This shit's pissing me off. I'm not gonna lie. But, <laughs> dude, <laughs> this shit bogus as fuck. Like, uh, but I know with Angelus, like, it's super thin. And as you do Hello Coats, it's, it goes on better. So, this is only the first coat. Then you can start globbing it on a little bit more. But, like, yeah. I mean, um, but, I mean, either either way... I'm going to be putting the other paint on it, and it's way thicker. I'll show you guys how, how my calipers look. And it's like that poor 15, POR 15 caliper paint. And it's way thicker than this, and it's like low-key darker than this. Uh, so, I mean, it's going to look way better in the end, but I just was low-key eager to do it. So, this is just going to be on my bottom coat. And then for my last coat, I'm going to use the the POR 15. Because, I mean, since, uh, since that's thicker and all that, like, it only would need one coat after that because I, I only need to get the lines right basically now. And then, you feel me? Like, you see how I haven't touched the black yet. All I have to do is not touch the black and then finish it off with a P, uh, P O R 15 caliper paint and then it'll be straight. I know I'm talking a lot, but yeah, that's basically the process. Just doing a lot of coats, being precise. The first coat is really the coat to get all the lines. And then the second one, second coat, you probably want to just, you know, glob it on and then, like, make it thick. So then it would last longer and look better and look more like, you know, one solid color. So, I mean, that's the process. It low-key looked dope already, do not it? From afar? Indeed, from afar. Oh, nice. bro. This is going to brighten up the whole observance. You know, that's my word, right? So that's going to be my word for you, too. Observance. Have somebody said that before? No, no. You don't know? I don't know where I got that from, bro. I'm not going to lie. I just started to say observance. I feel like you got that from Tall Guy, but I don't know. Probably. Probably. I'm not going to lie. I'm sorry from Tall Guy. I, I wouldn't even lie. <laughs> but where the fuck he get that from? What is a observance? Anyway. Know. I Alright, I'm going to start the other side. And, uh, yeah. So just stay in tune. I'm going to show you guys that. And then I'm going to show you guys, uh, like, second layers. How second layers look. And then third layers. And so on, so on, so on. So, check it out. Alright. I just want to stop for a second and show you guys the process right now, bro. Ooh. It gets ugly when you look close, but like for the most part, that shit sick as fuck. Y'all. I'm to try to spin this with one hand. <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> oh, what, what? I gotta go that way. Okay. Right here. Gee. Dude, this paint is wet on me. Look, I'm fucking up. All right, bro. I just cleaned it too. Anyways, but yeah, I just wanted to show you guys the process. Like, when you get close, you can see it's like lobbed on. But trust me, like the um, caliper paint is gonna do way better. Plus, I'm gonna do like another coat or so. Like before, it was looking way worse than this. Like it looked like that. This is the first coat look, and where's the second coat? So I mean, that looks way but wait, <laughs> that looks way better than that. So I mean, that's how you know. Like first coat to second coat, like the difference and. How they look, I guess. Well, it's still <laughs> that shit was bright as fuck. <laughs> nah, it was bright as fuck, bro. It was overly bright, bro. <laughs> I was I was trying to deal with that first, but then I was like, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I'm but anyways, we go we gonna uh, do some more coats and um, show y'all that. I mean, basically, it's gonna be us using the uh, Angelus right today, and then on what whenever I get my paint back. I'll use the other paint, so, to finish it off, basically, top coat, so, I mean, I'm gonna just do the other side, and do another coat here, and then do another coat here, and then hopefully I'm done after that, so, stay tuned. Hey, y'all, so here is the finished product, it look, it look good as fuck on camera, yo, uh, I'm not gonna lie, but at first thing, it look, it look bogus, like, y'all see that, how it look, but the last coat is gonna make it look way better, uh, it look, it looks way better than camera like y'all don't see none of that shit like honestly it looked bogus in person to be honest with y'all but yeah y'all gonna see the the end result gonna look way better bro uh yeah i mean nothing left, left to say this car is all right now bro but i i look you like how it would potentially look i love how it would potentially look especially once everything's done but that yellow looks sick as fuck bro just it's just different. I've never seen that shit on a G. And you see, Ro with the shades. It's about to be his birthday in like 13 minutes. So, his, this nigga, he geeked up probably. <laughs> a glass. <laughs> but, uh, I guess this is the end of the video for now. Um, 
nothing else to say. We finna die of car carbon. Yeah, you low key. Know. Low key. I don't think I ended one of the videos in a minute, but you know. I mean, it's not end of the video though. I thought you said it was end of the video. Till till next time. Oh, yeah, cause I'm a, I'm at the uh, you feel me the the caliper paint. Let me show y'all the calipers, bro. Like, like we glob the calipers on, and it was like like I tried to glob this on, but it's like weird, bro. Like this paint is just so thin. I don't know how to explain it. Like. It's just bogus. I'm not gonna lie to y'all, but uh, yeah. I mean, <laughs> I'm gonna show y'all the calipers. Damn, I just dropped that shit. All right, look how the caliper look. I know it's dirty, but like I globbed that on, and it came out like this. You feel me? Like smooth as hell. And if you scratch it, nothing. That ain't yeah. You see? That ain't like that, is it? Nowhere close. Right, that's lucky cold. That's a lucky a cold little hit. Not gonna lie. Especially on camera, look. That's just like cold as hell, yeah. So, I mean, uh, nothing else to say. You wanna end it? Rojo out for now. So, we are back, alright. And I have my caliper paint, my real caliper paint. So, this, look at this. Hold on. I don't know if y'all can see. Like, y'all see all them blobs and screech, screech marks. Like, it, it look good. But, like, it's just, like, a whole lot of blobs and screech marks. I'm about to get rid of all that shit right here, right now. Right here, right now. And I'm about to do something way better. Um, not way better, but, like, something to uh, make it look way better. So, uh, like, I, I know y'all can't tell off camera, but it low-key look kind of bad. Because um, it's, like, super thick because of the other Angelus paint or whatever that I used. But, I mean, bro, it looks dope as fuck to me. Like, it's going to look way better with this. So, I'm going to try to zoom in. Let me... Do you guys see all that? All that stuff, bro? That is because of the paint that I use. So, I'm going to have a thicker layer with this caliper paint. And I'm going to show you guys the difference. So, hopefully you guys see all that. Like, you see all those. It looks like fake because of that shit. So, uh, yeah. You'll see, you'll see, guys. All right, y'all. <clears throat> it's a lot glossier now. Like a lot gloss here a lot like type more finish type uh i don't know if i can zoom in yeah bro but i mean let me try to move it away but yeah it's like way better now like it's still wet right now just a little bit but now it's just a lot glossier and a lot like a type brighter yellow bro like this shit's cold as fuck Go to the other side. Uh, yeah, so I'm gonna do one last thing. I don't know if I can zoom in to show you guys the plus and minus or whatever. But I'm gonna do one last thing and then these should be done. Hold on, let's get the focus up, boy. But uh, yeah, painting my freaking paddle shifters. Shit's fucking dope as hell, bro. So, I mean, just stay in tune to the rest of the video. You guys gonna see the last things I do. And then I'm gonna um, basically try to end the video or whatever. So, I mean, stay in tune. Whoo! Alright, we are finally back with this. Alright, now, here's how it looks after the caliper paint. If you guys remember this. This caliper paint. Alright. If you guys remember it, I have put it on. Let me just move the wheel. And you guys can see it's like dotty. And it's high key dotty only because of the paint that I had on it before. So what I'm going to do right now, I'm going to wet sand it so I could like get rid of all these imperfections. And then I'm going to do another coat, then probably wet sand that coat. Yeah, look at this paint versus the glossy paint. Like... You see that right here? It's it's actually like really good, but then this paint it fucked it up. So yeah, so that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna use this uh, sandpaper right here and some water. I'm uh wet sand this down. I'm gonna show. I'm, I'm gonna show you guys that process. I don't know how I'm gonna do it with one hand, but I'm gonna show you guys the process a little bit. And this is what 240. So yeah, so I'm gonna just do that. All right, so I'm sending it now, and just going through it. 
trying to do this one handed. Not trying to take too much off. Going through sanding it off. Just basically sanding everything. And like this, this paint is really thick. So like, low key take a beating. Yellow off there. And then let me wipe this off for you guys real quick. Get a napkin, right? And I might not even need another coat after this, but it looks 10 times better now after that wet sand. So maybe, maybe I'll add one more coat. Look, so here's the difference between the wet sand, okay? So look at this. And then we're gonna turn it over here. Oh. And look at this. And we'll do the before and after on the wet sand on this side. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna do it on this side too. You guys see that versus this? It's a lot smoother. It's a lot smoother. Versus that wet sanded. So, I mean, that made a, a big difference. I, I honestly thought I had to paint it after this, but by the looks of it, I may not have to. I thought it was going to take off more, but it, it actually did not take off much. Yeah, you guys see those scratches though? So that's probably why I might um, add another coat and then wet sand again. So uh, just stay tuned to what I do, basically. So I'm going to just wet sand the other side and um, decide what I want to do. Alright, so now we just wet sanded this side. It looks a lot mm -hmm. smoother now. So good though. But I noticed I did horrible on this side, G. Not gonna lie. So, oh shit. I didn't realize my music was on, but yeah, I did horrible on this side. So, that's gonna get a new coat. Everything's basically the same now, but this one, I actually just repainted it. Okay, so that looks a lot better now a lot better so i mean just stay in tune to the build it's decent it's something decent like it's just cold just having yellow in is different than anything else so see motherfuckers just be walking past looking at me bro i don't know why maybe i'm interesting i don't know but i'm gonna get to painting this because i don't give a fuck all right y'all all right, so I have done this side. It looks a lot smoother. So I'm just waiting on that side to dry. Okay. Yes, sir. It looks way better. So this side is maybe dry or currently drying. I guess it still showed up kind of, you know, shaky, but it's better. Better than before. Definitely better than before. Smoother than before. And I don't even think it's all the way fully dry. But I may do one coat after this. Like you guys see how decent it is. So, I mean, that's probably like around the best that it'll probably get. Maybe I could wet sand a little bit more. I'm gonna try that one more time. Uh, try to do a light wet sand on, the, on this coat to see if it like smoothens out. But this is basically what we're gonna have now we're gonna see how it turns up after the uh, wet sand so just stay in tune to the uh, rest of the video it should be almost done maybe like one two more minutes of this video so let me just stay tuned to how the whole thing looks so far it looks really good to me at least and yeah so just stay tuned phone's going off all right so this is how it looks after the paint job now it looks way smoother than it did before you guys can clearly see that it looks way smoother so now i'm gonna just do one last set wet sand so i have an 80 a p80 it's like real, real kind of grippy um i'm gonna go light with that with wet sanding and then i'm gonna finish off with this so that's gonna pretty much rough all the extra pieces off and then yeah should be smooth by then all right so it is completely dry now you guys hear that slippery and all heat all right so now i am about to hit it with the wet sand you guys see all those little imperfections we're gonna see how those go away in a couple seconds so stay tuned to that wet sand and then yeah so remember i'm gonna hit it with this then i'm gonna hit it with this
to finish. So stay tuned. All right, so this is just after wet sanding with the 80 grit or whatever, the P80. And look at this. Look at how smooth everything has got. Yes, sir. So I am done with that side. I think that is about the best it could get. Maybe I'll hit it with the, the uh, like the smoothener, but this is perfect right now. So I'm about to go to the other side. That's looking really rough. So we'll see how that ends up. Just so you guys can see the, this side before. And then we're about to show you after, after I wet sand. All right, so it's a clear difference how much the wet sand has really done. I know you guys just seen all those imperfections on this, and this really, literally just was a wet sand, and I wiped it off. That's it, and it looks perfect now. So, that is the end of this video. Nothing left to say. Make sure you follow the gram. I'll, I'll walk out for y'all, y'all, you know what I mean? I'm gonna just leave all this stuff right here for now, cause you know, this, this, this Rona going around, and you know, people not going out the house. Including me, because you know, job you don't have one. <laughs> well, I do, but make sure you follow the gram Rojo Cars Inc. and subscribe to the channel. How's it oh, yeah, and I forgot to just do one thing Rojo out. <laughs>